Hello brothers and sisters. Today we're going to be implementing this paper called uh, Brave Broadening the Visual Encoding of Vision Language Models. Um, it outperforms blip, instruct blip, lava, and reaches state-of-the-art on uh, what is it? a bunch of benchmarks and stuff. So it reaches state-of-the-art on captioning and VQA benchmarks. So uh, we did one video on vision transformers already, but this paper just came out today. So we're gonna go ahead and start implementing this. Um, so we're gonna import torch. Um, we're gonna import torch, torch. Um, we're gonna import our feed forwards and we're gonna implement our feed forward and what is it, class attention. Um, class hmm. import multi query attention and what else do we need? We need um ah uh, yes we need class attention um, let's see okay now this may or may not be for images I'm not aware. Okay, I think, yeah, this should work. Okay, um, and we're also going to um, import a vision transformer wrapper, um, and also the encoder. So, and that's pretty much it. So let's uh, create a swarm of a swarm of bits. So um, we need to get the um, the parameters for the bit model. I'm just gonna copy and paste them from a repo I used earlier to save us some time. Uh, this can get quite lengthy if we don't do this. So, um, yeah, this is what it's going to look like. Um, say four. That's pretty good. Figure out the self. Don't ever forget the self. Okay, now um, we are essentially going to um, create a list of these uh, uh, vision transformers. And we're going to say tension layers equals to encoder. And then we're going to say uh, dim encoder dim def and that's pretty much it that's the swarm now we need a norm um, and then we also need a projection And so that's pretty much it for that. Um, so we're going to implement this uh, right here. So we just implemented all that. Um, now let's make the forward. normalize that um, then we're going to say for bits and so bits um, out equals bit x then we're going to um, this is going to be images uh, 
this is gonna be the shape of the template. Um, batch height with batch channels height width. Um, and then we're gonna say return embeddings because that's a parameter here. Um, yeah, so return embeddings. Those are gonna be three dimensional which we're going to get the shape there. Then we're going to normalize those projections. Uh, actually, yeah. So we're going to take that variable. Then we're going to um, we're going to project the output, and then finally we are going to concatenate um, all of them. So we can like now we need to check the PyTorch documentation for a concat. Um, So then we're going to concatenate along the S D, which is the sequence um, dimension. So we're going to uh, we're going to project C uh, vision embeddings like this. I think that might be it. Um, return vision embeddings, and then th that should be it. Uh, yeah. Okay. So that's that's it. Um, So then we're gonna run the we're gonna run um, the model and see what happens. Okay, now be prepared for some errors. Always be prepared for some errors. So we're gonna do this really quick, and then we'll get into the meek former. Um, So we'll do this quite quickly and then then we can finish up with that. Um, since this is going to take too long, I'm going to just start implementing it.
So the norm is a problem. Let's just try it again. See what happens. So here we're just initializing some common variables. Um, and then we are going to initialize attention. Um, but it doesn't take these parameters. It's hallucinating. Um, Yeah, so it's outputting the right shape. Um, speed forward. So dim. So dim, dim. Yeah, look at that. Oh no, that's that's the model. So speed forward is dim, dim, molt, and we're going to do swish, true, post act, true, drop out equals drop out, and then cross attention, yeah you see, so that, that's working. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Also, we need the um, learnable queries, which is uh, queries. Um, That's pretty much it. So let's implement this. Um, so first thing we do is um, the first thing is the self attention, which takes in um, the attention, which takes in. takes in the learnable queries and we're going to add a print. Um, so the first thing is the attention, then cross attention on the output. So we're going to say cross. takes an x and a constant so we're gonna we're gonna take who do you want the, to message who do you want to message no okay way. canceled okay. canceled oh, Siri sucks. so attention out um and then we're gonna have the image so then we're gonna have the image um, and that'll be it so then that goes to the feed forward um, which is this um, basically, learnable queries goes here, then cross attention gets the learnable concatenated vision, uh, vision features. And so, um, 
we do the feed forward, and now we need the text. Um, which is the X here. So the X goes into the feed forward. Um, and so we get the X equals text. Uh, so we're going to apply the f of n into the x, which is the original. Then we're going to concatenate. Um, defeated, and then the texted f n alongside the first dimension. And that's pretty much it. Um, so this is a, uh, this is returning a tuple. Uh, um, the swarm of bits is returning a tuple of a um, it's returning a tuple of the tensors that it added and then um, we're going to send that into the vision transformers We're going to add that documentation. Overall, pretty simple with Zeta. Um, Zeta is pretty much just pseudocode at this point. You can just very simply plug and play things and build amazing models from it. Um, what would have taken this team like months of, of research and integration testing only takes us a couple minutes. So this is the power of Zeta. Um, simple demo, I'm gonna finish this up uh, pretty soon, but I really wanted to demonstrate how easy it is to build complex architectures like this and essentially um, just build out models very quickly. Um, stay in tune for the next one. I'm gonna finish this up. You can find this repo at Brave Vitsform on my GitHub. So yeah, check that out if you're interested, and yeah, this was a new state-of-the-art transformer implemented in less than 20 minutes. Thanks for your time.